Write in figure 42,018. 42,000 written in figure raise 4, 2, comma, 0, 0, 0. And 18 written in figure beneath 42,000 starting from the father's right and side of the column you write them 8 followed by 1 in the next column okay remember this column on the father's right hand side is the unit column next is the tens column followed by the hundreds column and the thousands column and the last column is the Ten thousands column okay so adding up the two numbers in the farthest right hand side of the column you bring down eight the next column you bring down one the next column zero you bring down the comma then followed by two in the next column and finally in the last column you bring down Four. So this is forty two thousand and eighteen written in figure. So the answer option E is the right answer. Find the sum of zero point zero two, seven point four, and two point five eight. We add up these decimal numbers in columns, that is 0 0.02 plus 7.4 plus 2.58. So on the right hand side of the column where we have 2 and 8, we add that up so we have 10 so we write on 0 carry 1 to the next column so in this column now we have 1 plus 4 plus 5 which gives us 10 so write on 0 we bring down the decimal point then carry 1 to the third column so in the third column now we have 1 plus 7 plus 2 which gives us 10 so the answer option C is the right answer. What is the LCM of 16 and 24? We express the numbers as products of prime factors. So to easily do that, we divide 16 by the first prime number, which is 2. 2 and 16, we have 8. 2 divide 8 we have 4 2 divide 4 we have 2 then 2 finally divide 2 to give us 1 so the products of factors of 16 are all these numbers which are 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 next we look for the product of factors of 24 
also we divide by the first prime number 2 2 and 24 we have 12 2 and 12 we have 6 2 and 6 we have 3 2 no, can no longer divide 3 without remainder so we divide by the next prime number which is 3 3 and 3 that gives us 1 so the product of factors of 24 are all 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 so now we look for the lowest product of factors which contains all of the prime factors of the numbers all right so in 16 we have four twos so three twos are common product of factors of both 16 and 24 and we are to look for the LCM that is the lowest common multiples of 16 and 24 okay so 4 twos in 16 is not common in 24 so we write out the products of the four twos which are two times two times two times two then for the next factor three three is only common in 24 it is not common in 16 so we as well bring down three the factor three is less common we're looking for lowest common factor which as well could be like less common okay so now we go for the products we already know that 2 times 2 times 2 which gave us 16 so 16 now times 3 3 times 6 we have 18 so we write 8 we take 1 to the next column to add it to the product of 1 times 3 which gives us 3 plus 1 we are now have 48 so the LCM of 16 and 24 is 48 so the answer option E is the right answer express X centimeter in meters for 100 centimeter would give us 1 meter so 1 centimeter will give us 1 divided by 100 meters which will give us 0 0.01 meters all right that is for every centimeter we have 0 0.01 meters so to express x centimeter in meters it means that we have 0 0.01 x meters so the answer option a is the right answer when 5 is added to 6 times a number the result is 35 what is the number let that number be represented by the letter X so 5 plus 6 times the number which is 6 times X the result is equal to 35 now we minus 5 from both sides minus 5 5 minus 5 gives us 0 6 times x we have 6 x so 35 minus 5 we now have 30 so we divide both sides by 6 6 goes in the air 1 6 and 6 1 6 and 6 on the right hand side 1 6 divide 30 we have 5 so the unknown number which is x is equal to 5 the answer option b is the right answer if x plus 4 equals 6 what is the value of x raised to power 3 so first we find the value of x from the given equation x plus 4 which is equal 6 we minus 4 from both sides so we have x 
4 minus 4, 0. So x equals 6 minus 4, which gives us 2. So the value of x raised to power 3, which is 2 raised to power 3, is 2 times 2 times 2, 2 times 2, 4, 4 times 2, that gives us 8. So the answer option C is the right answer. If 3y equals 27, what is the value of y? We simply divide both sides by 3. On the left hand side, 3 cancel 3, we have 1, 1. 3 goes here on the right hand side, 1. 3 goes in 27, we have 9. So the value of y is 9. The answer option C is the right answer. If the product of 2 and 10 is divided by the sum of 2 and 3. The result is the product of 2 and 10 divided by the sum of 2 and 3. That gives us 2 times 10 gives us 20 to be divided by 2 plus 3 which gives us 5. So 5 goes in the air 1 5 goes in here, that's 4. So the result is 4. So the answer option C is the right answer. The three angles of triangle are in the ratio 2 to 3 to 5. Calculate the size of the smallest angle. The sum of the three ratios 2 plus 3 plus 5 are all equal to 10 and the sum of the three angles of the triangle is also equal to 180 degrees that is the sum of angles in a triangle okay so now obviously we know that the smallest ratio size ratio is 2 so 2 to ratio 10 multiply by the sum total of the three angles which is 180 0 cancel 0 2 times 18 gives us 36 degrees so the size of the smallest angle is 36 the answer option c is the right answer If the perimeter of a square floor is 32 cm, find its area. The perimeter of a square floor, LLL, that is the addition of all the sides of the square, which is 4L. We are given the perimeter as 32 we don't know the value of L so we we'll divide both sides to find out we we'll divide both sides by 4 4 cancel 4 on the right hand side on the left hand side 4 divides 4 at the denominator we have 1 4 divide 38 at the numerator we have 32 sorry we have 8 so L is 8. The formula for finding the area of a square is equal to L square. And now knowing the value of L as 8, we substitute that so we have 8 square. And that gives us 8 times 8, which is equal to 64 centimeter square. So the area of the square of the square floor is 64 centimeter. The answer option A is the right answer.